Okay, time to record the second video of today. And of course, I decided to hit the record button before I even put my gloves on. Or my headphones in. But man, as I have explained before, I've played Infamous 2. So I know some of the plot beats from the first one. But actually seeing why Zeke and Cole have such a icy relationship in the beginning of 2 makes complete sense. The man almost sacrificed. The man almost killed another thousands of people. You know the thing his best friend, be, best friend's been wrestling with since the beginning of this game, just to get freaking superpowers. Alden's tearing across that bridge, heading for the historic district. Stop him before he reaches the other side. Oh, okay. I've been trying to figure out how I would even get to this other section, but now I can see. Alden just blew right through the bridge. Okay. Yeah, this is going to be insane. Let me do that. Okay. Crap. Ah, uh, and my phone's ringing. Hang on. Sorry about that. Had to help out my mom real quick. Man. Okay. So, what's my game plan? All oh, right. What the hell is going on? Going up. There's something wrong with your phone. Every time I try and call you, I get disconnected. I don't have time to run tech support for you, boy. Figure it out yourself later. <laughs> yeah, just keep ghosting her. He's not gonna realize anything's up. Uh, crap. Okay, here we go. And of course, there's still barbed wire everywhere. Ooh. Jesus Christ. No. Oh my God. He almost leaped right off. Okay, I was about to say. Also, before we even got on this bridge, it's obviously like very foggy right now, but. I know you're back there, electric man. Ah. Wait a minute. Yeah, there we go. I can see like the the shadows of them. Like the faint gray shadows of them. Oh. There we go. Ha! Also, I increased the, sh the size of my force field. Thank goodness. Okay. Be really careful. It's so dark. It's like Silent Hill. But somehow worse. Okay. You won't stop me. No one will. Whew. Alden, this ends now. Or am I actually gonna fight him? Oh my god, he's got his own kaiju. Holy shit! Ignorant pisser. This is what my father wanted. You wanted me, to be a trash man, a homeless guy? I could see. My destiny will be fulfilled. You're like Kessler, craving what doesn't belong to you. None of you understand. See the truth, but I do. I see it all. 
Great, just shut up and fight. Can I even... Okay, I can. Alright. Am I supposed to intentionally shoot them back at him? Okay, hey. I got a direct hit on him. That was cool. Get a little more power. Normally I would just shockwave him, but... Hey. I get more energy back when I just shoot them with my lightning bolt, so that makes the most sense. And look at how long my energy bar is, by the way. It's picking up what? Oh. Just about half of the screen. Yeah. Just gotta remember all these different buttons. And what which power is activated by what. I mean, I'm so glad I got that shield upgrade. And also, blocking attacks with your shield also rebuilds energy. So all I just gotta do is. So all I gotta do is just uh, make sure I don't die. This is my birthright, my destiny. I would do some megawatt hammers right now, but I don't want to just just pencil on my power. Can compare with what I've endured. Would I survive? You and Kessler are one and the same. Oh, well, now he's going fire? Crap! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Woo! Yeah. Is that it? I'll kill you, that whore, and your thief of a friend! All of you! Wait! How does he know about Trish? Alden no longer seemed like a threat to anyone. Just some old guy howling about how Kessler had stolen his first son birthright. Then he changed his tone. Claimed he wanted to work with me to get revenge. To join forces and kill Kessler. The guy must have felt my hesitation. Because in that moment of indecision, I jumped. No normal man could have survived that fall. But Alden's a conduit. Same rules don't apply. Damn it! Either way, this thing's coming to a head. My enemies are all gathered here in the historic district. Kessler's preparing them for the final battle. Yeah, this is the finish line. Just wish I wasn't crossing it alone. We fight Sasha and then don't get to finish her off. We fight Alden and don't get to finish him off. Am I gonna actually finish any of these boss fights? Oh, look at that. A bunch of new side quests and everything. The price. Do I have to? It's only been like, what, less than 10 minutes? Picking up the trash. Nice name. Okay. Yeah, I definitely got the time for another level. I thought this was going to be much longer. Okay. Looks like I'm fighting the first sons now. Civic leader. Man, I can't get over how dark it's gotten now. This happened right after uh, Zeke set off the race sphere. But then again, this all seems to be happening within one single day. Can I do this? Can I hit him? Nope, he moved his head. Oh, my stick is not nearly as precise as I want to be. God. Ah. Oh, crap. I thought he was one of the turret guys. Wait. Surprise! Man, he took like seven hits. 
Jesus. I had so many defenses set up just to knock, just to make sure I didn't get over here. Now that Alden's out of the way, it's time to move against Kessler. And strategically, though, he's got you pinned in the historic district. Head over to the 19th Street Drawbridge and open it. That way you have an out in case things go haywire. 20 seconds. Where are you gonna be? I'll be there when you need me. Five seconds. Heard that one before. Okay. I was going to question, how am I going to get back to the other districts? I gotta go do the job bridge thing again. Yeah, should have absorbed a little more. Okay, not that far. So here's the thing. Zeke setting off the ray spear for the second time, it didn't turn off the power. It didn't cause like an EMP or anything. It's just that it just seemed like once that happened, everything turned dark. But then again, I have to remember this game is going by day by day by day. It's not all happening one day. Like the moon is out. I think this is one of the, this is one of the first times where I'm actually doing like a story mission in the middle of the night. There we go. Did I charge it up all the way? Okay, there we go. Our time together is drawing to a close, Cole. And I fear that you're still not ready to face what is coming. So I've decided to accelerate things. Evolve or die, as they say. Shall we begin? Oh, he's a conduit. Okay. You, Cole, how much you love her, but we all have our part to play. Even her, and that's why she's sitting here next to me. I planted a series of bombs across the city, and each is on a timer. Fail to disarm any of them before they detonate, and she dies. Cool. Are you serious? Engage the timer on the first bomb. You don't have much time. We really don't have time to fight all you guys. Come on. There it is. Oh, he didn't tell me there were prisoners within the electric field. I thought they were. Uh... Really? Back here again? Okay, no, but he didn't tell me that he had like, um, crap, why didn't I go back? There we go. He didn't tell me that he had hostages in these bombs. Cheating. But we all have our part to play. Even her. And that's why she's sitting here next to me. I planted a series of bombs across the city and each is on a timer. Fail to disarm any of them before they detonate, and she dies. Cool! Bastard. I've engaged the timer on the first bomb. You don't have much time. There you go. The game's going crazy. Come on. Let's go down. Okay, I guess I gotta finish them off before I get to the next location. Let's go. 
Two more people alive because of you, Cole. Someone's brother, sister. The next bomb is armed. Okay, I see it. There we go. That's five people now. Five people that will see another sunrise. But I wonder, did you save them because it was the right thing to do? Or because you're trying to protect Trish? Of course, Kessler's a massive dick. Need all these people to get out of here. So I accidentally shoot them. There we go. I've started the timer on the next bomb. There it is. Amazing, the things you forget. The smell of someone. The way their eyes light up when they're happy. Those are the things to cherish, Cole. Oh shit, I didn't realize I was stuck. Okay, back in. I'm so sorry. You need to get out of here. And these guys are smart. They're using the trees as cover. Thankfully, I have my own cover to work with. There we go. Just stay down. Are you kidding? More? Fine. Let's go. so good. I'm surprised there's no timer on any of the actual bombs. What? And it comes down to this. Your final test. From one roof hangs Trish. The love of your life. From the other, six doctors. Think of all the good they'll be able to do. The thousands of lives. Is Kessler just a joker? What the Trish hell? More important goal. The life of one, or the lives of many. Bombs are attached to each platform. You have time to save one, but not both. Choose. Hang on a second. Damn you. Damn you, Kessler. I hate you for making me do this. A 
I wish there was some other way that Trish didn't have to die. She's such a special woman. But in times of war, crisis, one must learn to ignore their feelings and do what benefits the whole, not the individual. Please get us down! No matter how painful. Damn. Good intentions. Time slowed down as Trish fell. All my powers, and I couldn't do a thing. For a second, she sprung to life. Just long enough to say that she was proud of me for what I'd become. Proud that I was helping people with my powers. And that she loved me for it. I buried her in the park alongside others who died since the blast. Kessler's gonna pay for this. I'm gonna find that sick bastard. And I'm gonna kill him. Yeah. Oh, and I can just visit her grave? That's cool. Wow. That is so messed up. Kessler put you through. Hell of a thing. Every minute that mad dog walks the planet, all of our lives are at risk. 75 seconds. Where the hell were you? If you'd only helped out, Trish might still be alive. Nothing I could do. She was dead the second Kessler got his claws on her. 51 seconds. Spare me that crap. You just didn't want to put your neck on the line. Expose myself to save one person? I don't think so. But I can help you get some payback. The power grid on the southern half of this island never got updated, so it still uses the old external substations. Turn on all three and you restore power to the rest of the island. Fifteen seconds. And give myself a new power in the process. Exactly. Okay, cool. I could go do the substation, but that might be pretty long and I'm already 22 minutes in, plus so much has already happened. So, I'm just going to leave that for tomorrow's video. So, thank you guys for watching. Oh, that was not fun to watch. Cool playthrough, though, but Jesus Christ. There's a reason why most of the games I play are story-based type of games, because I get invested in all these stories and these characters. It's just fun. And sometimes it's sad because I end up crying. I didn't cry this time. I'm not afraid to admit that some video games have gotten to me. But I appreciate you guys for watching. I hope you appreciate the two videos for Infamous today. And I will see you guys later. Peace.